all right, Pat, we've been working a lot and we're getting really, really close. And I think I figured out on film what's going to allow us to get that stretch between our back knee coming in and we see that back elbow drop independent of our hands. Now, first of all, as you take your stride, good. Everything's good, Pat. I just want you to watch right in here. Watch your hips. So you get down and then you get just a little bit of a slide. Now we start to turn, right? And I think that's why they come together just a little bit, right? And what ends up happening is it just throws off our direction just a little bit. So again, do a great job getting loaded. Then I'm gonna put the arrow on your chin and you can see because you get that little bit of a slide, right? And we don't get that great stretch between our hips and hands. See how your chin's come up just a little bit, right? And that prevents us from getting that extension right where we want it. We're, we're in fine tuning mode, brother. I mean, that's it, right? Really happy that we're getting down in a loaded position. Great, okay? But we've got just that little bit of slide right there. And you can just see, if you watch your top half, so you get a little bit of top half movement with that slide. And that's the position there that you're hitting out of. And that's why we see now, right, watch our lower half and our hands. See how they start to come together there, right? We don't get that stretch because, again, we hit and we just get a little tiny slide. And as we slide, see how your hands just start coming forward? Now we start to turn and we go good from there. But we get, and you can just watch your chin relative to the rope. It just comes up just a little bit, just a little bit. And we're just not quite all the way extended. So what I would recommend to you, Pat, we've mastered the get down loaded. Now let's just hit from there. Just rotate, just, just see, let's see that back knee come in from there. If we see that back knee come in from there, we would still see those hands staying up there. And we would see that back elbow lead. Instead, we get just that little bit right there, man. That's what we want to take out. That little bit of a leak right there. From there to there. Okay, now we're going to start to turn. But we just come up and around just a teeny tiny bit. So again, we're getting down loaded good. We want to take out that slide. That's what we want to get rid of. Okay.